my channel. Uh, today, uh, we're going to learn about the uh, chemical bonding. Chapter 5, Form 4, KSSM, uh, Chemical Bonding. So in this chapter, students need to remember five types of bonding. It start with the uh, first bonding is known as ionic bonding. Ionic bonding, uh, first bonding is ionic bonding. Ionic bonding. Then the second bonding will be covalent bonding covalent bonding and the third bonding is known as dative bonding and today's video i will cover the dative bonding okay and the fourth bonding will be known as hydrogen bonding hydrogen bonding and the last chemical bonding is known as metallic metallic bonding all the element that unstable element they tend to achieve or uh, tend to form a chemical bonding to achieve to achieve a stable stable octet octet or duplet duplet electron electron arrangement in order to achieve a stable octet or duplet electron arrangement the chemical element so the element tend to dsa they tend to donate tend to share or Accept, accept electrons to achieve duplet electron arrangement except accept uh, noble gases because these noble gases already are chemically inert they are known as what chemically chemically inert or chemically stable because they already achieve stable duplet or octet electron arrangement okay and uh, these are uh, noble gases normally uh, we have neon we have uh, helium, we have argon, we have krypton, we have xenon, and we have radon. All these elements, they already achieve stable octet electron or duplet electron arrangement. Radon, they already achieve duplet or octet electron arrangement and always exist as monoatomic gases other element other element okay they tend to donate share or accept electrons to uh, form chemical bonding to achieve stable duplet or octet electron arrangement and today in this video i'm going to cover about the dative bonding so what is dative bonding try to look at this two person try to look at this two person this person a this person B. Okay, this uh, person A have uh, two electrons. Okay, and this is known as unshared, unshared pair of electron. This unshared pair of electrons is known as lone pair. This lone pair of electron can be donated to the person B who does not have this person. Okay, does not, does not have or as electrons electrons in the valence shell valence shell and this type of bonding is known as dative bonding where the electron pair that shares is comes from only one atom the person a can be ion or atom and this person gain only uh, accept or share electron from the donor so therefore this person is known as acceptor and the person who donate the unshared pair of electrons is known as donor so now we try to look what is mean by dative bonding Okay, dative is a special type of covalent bond where the electron pair that is shared share is come from only one atom. The atom that contributes the share pair of electrons is known as donor. Okay, the atom or ion that accept the electron pair from the donor does not have any electron in the valence shell. Thus, okay, it shares the electron pair from the donor atom. And the ion or atom that accept the electron from the donor atom is known as acceptor. Okay, example of donor atom is nitrogen atom. The symbol for nitrogen atom is N in present in the 
ammonia molecule again okay, nitrogen atom in ammonia molecule we'll try to check we try to do the lewis dot structure so here ammonia ammonia molecule the formula of ammonia molecule nh3 this is made up of nitrogen atom three hydrogen atom the proton number of nitrogen atom is seven one 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 hydrogen atom as a uh, one uh, proton number okay we try to do the electron configuration 2.5 1 1 1 nitrogen need three electron to achieve octet while all the hydrogen atom need one electron to achieve duplet electron arrangement and i try to do levis dot structure the levis dot structure is focused on the balanced electron so i'll put the nitrogen as five electron two year one year one one so each hydrogen atom will share okay a pair of electrons form single covalent bond this is known as bonding bonding electron electron pair therefore the three hydrogen atom they will form single single covalent bond and this nitrogen atom in uh in chemionia in ammonia molecule as one lone pair and this is known as lone pair of electron which can be shared to the atom or ion which does not have any electrons in the valence shell example of atom or ion that uh, does not have electron in the valence shell is hydrogen hydrogen proton number one nuclear number one we try to check the subatomic particles proton electron and neutron present in the hydrogen atom the hydrogen atom has one proton and one neutron and neutron uh, one electron sorry one neutron neutron will be one minus one will be zero okay and when this hydrogen atom form hydrogen ion with the formula of h positive we try to check the three subatomic particle the proton remains the same electron has been donated so zero and neutron will be zero that means this hydrogen ion hydrogen ion does not have any electron in the valence shell and this hydrogen ion need uh, two two electrons need two electrons to achieve to achieve okay stable stable duplet duplet electron electron arrangement therefore this hydrogen atom will combine with the ammonia molecule through formation of dative bonding okay try to check point number five example of donor atom in nitrogen atom okay uh, from ammonia molecule the symbol for ammonia molecule nh3 nitrogen atom has proton number of seven therefore the electron arrangement is 2.5 it has a uh, five electron and need three more electron to achieve stable octet electron arrangement so we try to draw the lewis dot structure so this is hydrogen ion atom okay share a pair of electrons so with the nitrogen atoms okay and this type of bonding is known as uh, bonding electron huh? so this type of electron so they form single three single covalent bond they form uh, three single so they form single covalent bonding and this nitrogen atom has one lone pair of electron that we can be shared with hydrogen atom look at point number five seven hydrogen atom hydrogen ion sorry has no electron in its uh, valence shell this hydrogen ion need two more electrons to achieve stable duplet electron arrangement okay therefore the nitrogen atom in ammonia molecule will share the lone pair with hydrogen ion through the formation of dative bonding okay we try to check point number eight the lone pair or electrons that not involved in the formation of covalent bond okay in ammonia molecule will be shared with hydrogen hydrogen ion through the formation of dative bonding with the formula of nh4 positive uh, this ion is known as ammonium ammonium ion all nitrogen atom and hydrogen hydrogen atom in ammonia ammonium 
ammonium ion okay as a chief stable octane octane and duplet electron arrangement okay now we try to draw Lewis electron the arrangement for ammonium ion which is nh4 positive so i'll put an ammonium uh, ammonium molecule so this is hydrogen atom they combine okay uh, this is the formula for the ammonia molecule will be hydrogen ion will share the lone pair lone pair with the ammonia nitrogen uh, atom in ammonia molecule they will form ammonium ion so here we have a lone pair which share with hydrogen ion so this is bonding pair okay this is the like lewis dot structure for the formation of dative bonding for the uh, ammonium ion where we can see here the formation of dative dative bonding okay we move on to next part uh, we try to answer essay question regarding the uh, formation of dative bonding by using another example try to look at this essay question describe the formation of dative bonding between hydrogen ion and water molecule can be explained by using two example number one is known as ammonium ammonium ion with the formula of nh4 positive and number two will be hydroxonium hydroxonium ion h3o positive and this formation of hydroxonium ion between water molecule and hydrogen ion involves two type of bonding h3o positive two type of bonding first bonding is covalent covalent bond and another bonding is known as dative bonding and we try to answer the essay question before we answer the essay question we need to do the formation of dative bonding with uh, in hydroxonium ion so hydroxonium ion in the water molecule the formula of water molecule h2o okay the water molecule formed between oxygen atom and two hydrogen atom the proton number of oxygen atom is eight and the proton number of hydrogen atom is one we try to draw lewis Donnie electron arrangement 2.611 oxygen atom need two electron to achieve stable duplet octet and uh, hydrogen atom need one more electrons to achieve stable duplet electron arrangement and we try to draw the formation of hydroxonium ion so oxygen atom as two lone pair two four and this one electron has been shared with hydrogen atom and one more electron has been shared with hydrogen atom in the formation of water molecule so we have hydrogen ion which don't have any electrons in the valence shell so the formation of hydroxonium ion we open bracket we try to draw oxygen atom the lone pair will be shared with hydrogen ion and we have uh, one more lone pair so this pair electron is shared with hydrogen atom one more electron has been shared with hydrogen atom it form hydroxonium ion with the formula of h3o positive the name of this ion is known as hydroxonium ion once we draw this then we start to answer the essay question Okay, now we try to uh, describe the formation of dative bonding between hydrogen atom and water molecule in hydroxonium ion oxygen atom from water molecule we have to write the symbol of water molecule can share share its lone pair one lone pair of electrons to hydrogen hydrogen ion form dative dative bonding in water molecule oxygen atom has achieved stable octet octet electron arrangement and two other hydrogen atoms has achieved stable duplet electron arrangement the hydrogen ion does not has any electrons in the valence shell and it need two electrons to achieve stable duplet electron arrangement the lone pair from the oxygen atom from the water molecule which are not involved in the formation of covalent bond in water molecule will be shared share 
with hydrogen ion through formation of dative dative bonding thus hydroxonium hydroxonium ion with the formula of h3o positive is formed in hydroxonium hydroxonium ion the formula h3o positive oxygen atom and hydrogen atom have achieved stable octet and duplet duplet electron arrangement respectively okay uh, that's how we try to answer the essay question after we answer uh, describe we need to draw the formation of dative bonding in hydroxonium ion okay so that's all from me thank you very much okay thank you very much okay from sir jaya and always remember tomorrow tomorrow never dies always always for us okay if you like my video please uh, subscribe and share okay i have to uh, see more content on the chemistry thank you very much take care